you are so lucky right now. I might even be a bit jealous because you're about to embark on your first cigar journey. And that is a journey on one of life's finest pleasures, a journey of time and cigars that are all natural, premium, handmade tobacco leaves. You know, very few things left in the world are completely all natural, and even fewer things in that are still made from hand the entire process start to finish. So this is truly something special. What's going on guys? Welcome to the Sigma Nato channel. My name is AJ and that first step on this journey is the most important one. So whether it's your first cigar or you're going to introduce someone else to the world of premium cigars, I'm going to share with you five of the most ideal introductory cigars. They are easy to smoke, easy to pick up on all of the flavor notes, and they will give you a great cigar experience that you will be trying to capture again for a long, long time. So let's make sure you start this journey off on the right foot. This list is in no particular order, but some things you're gonna consider is smoking time and price. So just make sure you choose whatever is best for you. Other than that, any one of the cigars in this list are perfectly suitable for that first cigar. Now, without any further ado, let's get into it. First up on the list is the Davidoff Signature Number no. 2. The price on this cigar comes in around $23. It is a 6 inch by 38 ring gauge cigar, so you can expect about a 45 minute to 1 hour smoke time. It's definitely the most expensive cigar on this list, but you can ask any aficionado, Davidoff cigars are absolutely worth the money. It's a very subtle smoking cigar with nuanced flavors. And this is perfect for a beginner because it won't overwhelm them. It's also a nice mild cigar. Some flavor notes you can expect with a Davidoff cigar are gonna be in that woodsy and earthy type of tones. You're also gonna get a nice sweetness, whether it be floral sweetness or even some vanilla sweetness as well. One thing I love to pair with a Davidoff cigar is either a cappuccino or a latte. These type of pairings will really bring out that vanilla sweetness in the cigar. Absolutely love it. And don't be mistaken, the signature number two is enjoyed not only by beginners, but seasoned aficionados as well. This is a great cigar. At number two, we've got the Arturo Fuente short story. It measures at four inch by 49 ring gauge. So as the name suggests, it's a shorter smoke. Expect this thing to burn for a good 45 minutes. Price for this cigar is typically around $7, a very well-priced cigar for the quality of smoke you are gonna have. What I love about the short story from Fuente is it provides a full cigar experience without the full length of time. So within 45 minutes, you will get a very solid cigar experience. And that's thanks to the mild to medium strength of this cigar. It does have a little bit of a kick to it, but nothing over the top. It's an excellent cigar for any time of the day. You can enjoy this in the morning, late afternoon, or even on an evening. Some of the flavor notes you can expect from this cigar, thanks to that African Cameroon wrapper and the Dominican fillers and tobaccos in this cigar, you can expect tons of sweet and spicy notes. I just love the balance of sweet and spicy from this cigar personally. You can expect notes like cinnamon and break bread and other sweet and spicy notes as well. And that's the Arturo Fuente short story. Great first time smoke, but also the seasoned veterans love this for a quick smoke as well. And next at number three, we've got the Perdomo Champagne Epicure. Price for this cigar is typically around $9. It is a six by 54 ring gauge cigar. So it's definitely gonna be that full cigar experience. You can expect this to burn between an hour and a half to two hours. And I gotta say, this is one of my personal favorites to have on that weekend morning or late afternoon with a cup of coffee. This cigar just really does it for me. It's always consistent with the flavors. It always has a great burn and great construction. This cigar also packs a punch, so keep that in mind. It's definitely on the medium side, maybe even a little bit fuller on the uh, strength as well. The Perdomo Champagne 10th Anniversary always produces a great smooth smoke. Some of the flavor notes you can expect from this cigar are tons of sweet cream, cedar, vanilla, and even some woodsy notes as well. This is a great cigar to have that's right in the middle of the road for strength, 
but has plenty of nuance, plenty of flavors, and a great smoke time as well. This is a solid first time cigar. Next up at number four, we've got the Oliva Connecticut Robusto. This cigar is typically around $8 in price range, very well priced. It's also a five inch by 50 ring gauge cigar. So it kind of falls in between of that short smoke and the full Toro size cigar. So this thing, you can expect it to burn for a good solid hour. This is another buttery and smooth cigar, something you can expect from these Connecticut shade wrappers. It's also a solid mild cigar, so it's definitely great for a beginner as well. And this is another consistent tasting and excellent quality cigar. It pairs well with a cup of coffee in the morning or even in the midday as well. So onto the flavor notes that you can expect when enjoying this Oliva Connecticut Robusto, you will get some woodsy notes, some creamy notes, and some hints of vanilla as well. Maybe even a little bit of spice thanks to that Nicaraguan tobacco. This cigar is just perfect for someone that doesn't have a lot of nicotine tolerance. It's great tasting while being very mild. And last on the list, we've got the Ashton Classic Double Magnum. Now this cigar price wise is $14 typically. So it falls right in the middle of the range of the cigars I've got here on the list. Of course, as you would expect, it's got amazing construction and quality of tobaccos in there as well. And it's a six inch by 50 ring gauge cigar. So another full cigar experience. You're gonna be smoking this for at least an hour and a half to two hours. And it's got a nice mild to medium strength. So I would say this is definitely a proper sit down and unwind type of cigar. And actually this was my first proper cigar. I mean, I, my first actual cigar was in Mexico, which was probably a fake Cuban. But when I got back to the States, I wanted to have a proper cigar experience and this was a cigar that I had and I remember that thing burning for two hours plus I was smoking it so slowly I didn't think it was ever gonna go out and the flavors were just phenomenal I still remember the next day even my coat my palate was completely coated with all these woodsy flavors and ever since then I just got hooked on cigars so this is a great cigar to enjoy Definitely for someone new, it's going to hit you uh, with that medium strength as well. So make sure you're on a full stomach before you enjoy this cigar. And flavor notes to expect, you're going to get some of those sweet and spicy notes, woodsy notes, creamy notes, and some cinnamon as well. And actually any of the cigars on this list, being that you are just a complete beginner at this point, make sure you smoke on a full stomach. And if you happen to get any of that nicotine sickness, just reach for your favorite snack or candy of choice or even drink of choice to kind of uh, alleviate that and it'll pretty much help right away. I had a few guys asking about proper beginner cigars. This is definitely gonna be it. And I would say that this isn't even just for beginner cigars. You know, a lot of cigar aficionados still enjoy these cigars on a daily basis regardless for anyone that's been smoking full bodied, full strength cigars. It'll be a nice change of pace to try one of these as well. I myself, I enjoy any one of these cigars at any time still, and I've been smoking for a couple of years now. So yeah, that pretty much wraps it up, guys. I hope you guys found this video helpful. Thank you for watching.